Hey guys, great to see you. Welcome back. So this is for those of you who are just kind of plectrum players and would like to be able to try and have a go at the Peter Green song, Man of the World, that I covered, okay, in the previous lesson. So what we're looking to do with our plectrum is to play... So that's the first little thing we need to get down. So we're just playing a D chord, then off with that first string that we're fretting, then we're hitting the second string. That's very important before we put that finger back down. So we've got, then we go to this A sus two chord, just the third and fourth string, second fret, right? And we're just gonna play bottom five strings. Then we're going to play our G minor, right? And we're looking to just do that, essentially. Now, what we've got to try and do here is avoid the fourth and fifth strings, right? Because we're not fretting them. Now, a way you could do this is to play... Just play a G minor back to a D. But if you want to get that... G sus 2 in there really, right, which is that chord, which is where you as effectively you're playing the third string on the second fret and the second string on the third fret, as well as your thumb over the top. But you mustn't play the fourth and the fifth strings if you can help it, right? So so far we've got back to D. I'm gonna do that again. This time we're going to go to E minor and then B minor. And this is where he starts to sing the verse. So it's I could tell you about my life. So it's just what we've done, right? They say I'm a man of the world. Or you can play your G minor. Say I'm a man of the world. Today. Flown across every time. So that's just the D with the D sus two and the A sus two. All right. It's the E minor now. I've seen lots of pretty girls. So that's just E minor and B minor. Pretty girls. Quick A. Now that's quite hard to do with the plectrum, right? Uh, it's important that you reference back to part one of this video. We're playing the G minor. And this is the G sus 2 when we go to that position. Right, so that's the G minor. That's the G sus 2. And we're going. And that, we play this position as well. Where the thumb frets the top string, second fret. So it's going third, second, and off. Right, so we've got... You've got to be looking to do something like that, or you can just. So if you want to keep it really simple, you can just do that and forget all those other kind of sus two bits, right? And if you were to play it, it's very, very simplest form of verse. You could play, I got everything I need. I couldn't ask for more. There's no one I'd rather be I just wish I'd never been born Okay, now that's the very, very simplest you're ever going to be able to play the song, right? Because we're not doing any of this. just strictly playing very basic chord shapes all right so at least this is one way in which you know if you if you are new to the guitar you haven't been playing very long and some of these other concepts are just a little bit out of reach for you then this is a, a kind of way into the song for you perhaps all right so that's how the verses essentially go and then we come to an instrumental bit which is essentially just like the intro Now at 
that point, it goes to an F sharp minor, and it's and the words that go with that is I need a good woman, feel like a good man should. E minor. Then we're gonna go back to an F sharp minor. I'm not saying I'm a good man. And then we're going back to an E minor. But I would be if I could. And we looked at that in part one. Essentially an A7. Then we slide to that shape. And then the third little position, second and fourth strings on the fifth fret. So you have. And try and just hit the strings that you're fretting. So if you're a beginner or like I say, you know, the, the advanced version of the song is a little bit too much for you and you're never really totally sure about what strings you should be strumming, then just go with the ones that you're fretting. It's usually a safe bet, right? And so that's how you're coming out of that. Essentially, it goes to that, finishes there, and then he's back into another verse. So I tell you about my life. A sus 2, right? Then we got our G minor. I keep you amused. I'm sure to a day about all the times of crying. A sus two, E minor. I don't wanna be B minor sad anymore. And then we're into this. It plays the intro again, right? And then it finishes with this. So that's a kind of alternative way you can play the song, right? It's a, you know, for anybody who's struggling with the original version, because if I'm being perfectly honest, it's quite a difficult way to play the song in part one of the lesson. So this could be your way into the song. And, you know, very often, if you can get familiar with this, then to take that next step to the original version is, of course, a whole lot easier because you're familiar with some of the shapes and, more importantly, perhaps the timing of the song and things. So I hope that that helps you guys. And if you have any questions, as ever, do drop those down below. I'm always kind of here to try and help you out if I possibly can. And I look forward to seeing you soon with another lesson. In the meantime, you take care.